He All right, so guys and girls, one. there's going to be some squilling and some squalling because she's going to evaluate them. Dylan's probably going to hold them up for us so she can count their teats. But for us, so I'll just go ahead and tell you guys how we do it. The AKKPS does not require waddles on the Cooney Coonies. It's a desired trait. Mm -hmm. We personally, our breeding stock all has waddles. But we know that even two waddled pigs, even two waddled pigs with three generations of two waddled parents, you not you will not always get waddles in the offsprings. It's just the way it goes. It's more of a recessive thing than anything. And the waddles do not impact the pig's ability to be a pig, the pig's ability to be a mother, or any of those things. So for us, that is not a criteria that we adhere to. When we first started out with Cooney Coonies, we had a Cooney mentor who add it to the standard and didn't just strictly follow the standard so there were a few piglets that we did not register simply because we were not aware that they did not have to have waddles or that they did not have to have an even number of teats it simply says in the breed standard 10 teats a minimum of 10 teats evenly spaced it's really cold out here y'all so we're gonna make this quick days old, so. yeah so we're gonna make this quick we're just looking them over see which one we may want to keep but also a lot of people are asking us which ones might be registered, which ones may, may not be registered and all that. Now, another thing that we do care about beyond the teats, we care about the body conformation. We're definitely not going to register any piglets whose body conformation is not the way it should be. We want a nice strong back. It can either be level or slightly arched, but no sagging. We want a thick, broad chest and a well-rounded ham on them because, again, Yes, they make awesome pets, but it's also awesome meat, and we want to grow good meat. The other thing that we look for, we will not register one with taco ears or tightly folded ears. The ears can be erect or inclined forward, but we do not want tightly folded ears because it makes them more predisposed to getting ear infections and things of that nature, so we don't breed stuff to that standard. Now, Mama Dreams, what do you have there? Boy, high white, black spots. Boy, he has boy. no waddles. Uh, no his waddles. ears are good. Uh, he is he is the biggest. Yeah. His back is good. Oh yeah. Now we don't evaluate their back when she's holding them like that. We've already looked at the piglets. Oh yeah, we've looked at them walking and standing. Um, All of these piglets have beautiful, strong backs. Oh yeah. So that worked out really Tippy's well with this litter. litter. Is amazing. Yeah, they're a bunch of chunk monks. The next thing that we will look for is Dylan. You have to hold him up. Honey's gonna squeal. But uh, and she's counting teats to so make one, sure he's two, got at least ten. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. He, he's got twelve teats. Twelve teats. Seven. Good deal. Now, for us personally, the minimum requirement is 10, but we do not keep a guilt ourselves. that will be a future sow with less than 12 teats. 14 teats is even better. But again, that is just something that we added to the standard that is not required. 10 teats is the minimum for the standard. All right, baby. On to the next one. Y'all, it is. I feel like the temperature has dropped since we took that little break inside. My hands is chilly. Alrighty. This is a white with black spots. She's calling out the colors for Genesis. Genesis that she's a market down, down, guys. And this is a girl. Little lady. And she has two waddles. I know. Little I dual know. waddled baby girl. Her ears are good. We'll check her teats in a minute. Just want to give her a minute to calm down once Genesis gets all that real yeah. good. Mm -hmm. Alright. Moving hands up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, ten. And she has eleven. She has eleven teats. So she meets the standard. For us, we would not personally keep her, but that's because we're trying to get closer and closer to show stock. But there's absolutely nothing wrong with that little cutie at all. And she'll be a good mama one day. Yeah, All righty. Yeah, she got a big old butt on her, too. I've seen that. I like big pig butts. Oh, that's a big <laughs> one. So this one is black with white spots. Nice. Black with white. Black with white spots. Mostly black. The white spots. Okay, okay. Ears are good. Yeah. Girl. She's getting to it. Boy. A big old boar. Big old boar. <laughs> Good gravy, buddy. No waddles. Uh, no waddles. 
she has no water. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and he has twelve. Twelve sheets, big boy. Put him down. I believe there's right? only one other one in this litter that we've got to evaluate. Are there two more? She has five. She has five. So so where are we at? Some more. That was Three? number four? Oh, okay. Okay. Hi. Okay. All right. Okay. Mostly black. So mostly G. black with uh, little white spots. Hi. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm shivering. I got cold. This is a girl. Mm. 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 Another thing she's checking. No no water on her. Another thing she's checking, y'all, that I forgot to mention is we check their teeth also just to make sure they're going to be able to graze and forage well, that they've got a good jaw alignment and they've got good teeth starting to come in. Did you put no waddles? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Those sweet babies. All right, all right. It's cold, too. Yeah, y'all, it is really cold out here. You saw that piglet's breath. It's cold, so they're not too happy that we're grabbing them from under the heat right now. I think it's, what, 12 degrees by now? The day started I out. I have not checked. We've the day started out. out in the negatives. We've been out here so long, I haven't checked. I know, baby. All right, Dylan's getting the last one for her. Okay, this is white, black spots, also considered a highlight. Yeah. Now, I'll tell you, the AKKPS Girl. has a color chart. If you don't know the colors, you can get on there. And sometimes we have to get on there ourselves just because we get such a variety in colors in these piglets. I want to make sure, yeah, that I got it documented uh, right. Because uh, Tootsie, what is that? The, the Goody or something? Yeah, Goody. Yeah, the Goody. brown. And yeah. I love that color on yeah. piglets. Um, okay, so you got no waddles. Oof. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and she has ten. Ten teats. And there you go. Cutie pies, cutie pies. Not so those are tippies, babies. Yes. And I'll get up and show you them a little bit. Oh, man, I'm cold. Here they go. So we brought that lid in here. It's a shallow tray. We've been starting to work on getting them mashed today they're not quite sure what it was so they played in it more than they did anything but their mama cleaned it right on up for them yeah now we're going to go evaluate cookies little porky babies <laughs> all right y'all so we're going to check out cookies babies now cookie is off tippy yep cookie was our daughter that we kept from tippy's first yep. litter uh with us and cookie is a great mom just like her mom tippy mm -hmm. and a big girl just like her mom tippy yes they are uh, so we really like that because we are breeding more towards size than trying to make little small pets we want them to be pets if people want to keep them as pets because of how nice they are but we are raising these dudes for their awesome meat okay. yeah. <laughs> you know the truth Reality. oh no look at that little cutie is that black eyed susie uh, I think maybe I don't know. She may saying. be a keeper, yo. We're just we've not yet. Yeah, I think that's black eyed Susie. Yeah, that's black eyed Susie. We have not yet counted her teeth. Depending on what her teeth count is, though, she may be a stick around her. Girl, yeah. There you go. That was my ringtone for a long time, y'all. All right, mama. Ten. Oh, girly. Are you sure there's only ten in there? Yeah. Again, y'all, ten is perfectly... That's okay. Ten is perfectly acceptable by the breed standard. For our personal lines, though, we're keeping more teats than ten. They have big. They can have big litters. Yeah. All right, next, babe. Appointment on the board. Easy. All right. White, black spots. Wait, is that black eyed Susie? Look at the eye on that one. That one might be it. I don't know. We yeah. had a brown eyed Susie. It doesn't matter. It's just, uh, they, it's they named one of the piglets when it was first born Black Eyed Susie because it had a perfect little black eye. Right, with, yeah. It's really clean and black, but yeah. 
Yeah, this one's more of a creamy blood. Ears of blood. And you are a girl. Yeah. And no two bottles. Oh, yeah. Cookies later had a lot of bottles. You get all did. She has 12. She has 12. Now, that's probably going to be the one we keep as Black Eyed Susie. All righty. The 12 teak girl. That's our standard. That is our personal standard. We add it to it. Yeah, it's our preference. You look like Oreo. Hold on. Okay. Anywho, you gotta give me a color. Okay. So, um, this is a black with white spots. This is a boy. It's a boy. Um, M's a boy. You guys have two wives. So, for this one, we already know that we are going to. Um, That's the one that we think might have a hernia? Yeah. yeah. So, I'll show you when I flip him over, but he will most likely go as a meat pig. Yeah. He's just a meat pig. So See it? He's See that swollen right there? Yeah. It's okay. I know, buddy. So, so we're not worried about his teeth counter, none of that. Right. We're not going to register that guy. That's a possible. <laughs> yep. And so that's something to learn too with the with the Kearney Kearneys. Um, there are certain lines that do throw the hernias. Um, Mahia Love was known for that, and Mahia Love is in a lot of the founding stock of the Kearney Kearneys. And a lot of people have just tried to diversify and get away from line breeding that Mahia Love into their lines. All right, this is no, 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 no. Anywho, yeah, don't let that one go because we gotta check it. Go and get it. This is white, black fox. Two waddles. Boy. You need to put a mark next to the one with the hernia so we know. Yeah, I know there's a line out where there's no teats. Okay. Awesome. Well, that's it, y'all. That's how we evaluate them. We'll take some individual pictures of them, and that'll be that for this litter and Tippy's litter. We're really excited about them, and we'll have to do some thinking on little black eyed Susie, see how she grows. All right, y'all. As always, till next time. Keep dreaming.